Hello everybody, Tyler Rowland here. We're at Blue Ridge High School and welcome to this edition of Rowland Sports where you meet the athletes. With me here from Peninsula Catholic, we have Kareem Stagg at 6'8". He's only 14 years old, but he's come in and really impressed at this showcase. And Kareem, first off, talk about this and what, it, what it's meant to you to get to come in, to be seen by several different coaches, and have the opportunity to potentially continue to develop your game to play at the next level. It's a blessing, honestly, coming in with coaches and stuff. You know what I'm saying? It's good to see for some good exposure and stuff. But, yeah, I, I just can't wait to just keep playing, man. Can't wait. Mm -hmm. And talk about the weight room and the importance of that. I noticed one thing. You're only 14 years old, and you have handled yourself really well against players that are about your size and juniors and seniors at this showcase. Yeah, like, obviously those guys are going to be stronger because they've been in the weight room longer. I just try to hold my ground, especially when they're posting me up. You know what I'm saying? I kind of deny stuff so they don't get it. But, yeah, I try to hold my ground a lot. Mm -hmm. awesome. And, and what is the, the challenge you're facing right now at age 14? You're still growing into your body. Um, talk about that and what it's been like the past couple years, just getting used to that and playing at the high school level. So I've been playing at the high school level since eighth. I've always played like JV tournaments like and stuff. So I've been used to playing up. I haven't really played my age group unless I'm going to like a session, like an EYBL session. But honestly, it's... It's really normal to me, you know what I'm saying? Being 14, I've always been tall. Like, even when about fifth grade, I've always been like 5'10. I've always been taller than all the kids. So, you know what I'm saying? It's, I'm used to it. Mm -hmm. like, and what what's something that you feel like over the past year that you've learned and, and improved at on your game? Um, I think running the floor a little more and trying to be active on the boards, like, trying to just dunk everything get excited, get your team up and stuff. So I think try to do that more. And then it just, it just goes all along with that. Mm -hmm. so. and, and this year, what's something you're going to look at to continue to develop in your game? Uh, my jump shot, my ball handling. I get the rebound, I try to push it a little bit to get the break started. Because like a lot of bigs aren't going to try to run the floor, especially if you like maybe 240 kind of big guy. So. Mm -hmm. When you get the rebound, just push it and you know what I'm saying? try to get to the rim, but you see people just kick it out. You know what mm -hmm. what I'm saying? So. And now for the for your fan base to get a, to know you a little bit better, what's something maybe some of your hobbies that you like to do when you're when you're off the court and not busy academically or playing basketball? Uh, I'm usually I'm, I'm a gamer a little bit, and then I'm always in the weight room. I always got a, I got a little trainer in Virginia Beach. So I'm usually going there probably two or three days a week. So I just always try to get to work in, especially when I'm not on the court and stuff. So, mm -hmm. yeah. Nice. And what games do you like to play? Uh, 2K and Fortnite, definitely. Nice. Who's your team on 2K? Uh, the Bucks. Giannis, can't nobody stop them anymore. Yeah. <laughs> Unstoppable, yeah. And, and lastly, Kareem, are there any shout-outs you'd like to give? Uh, Shout-out to my mom, my sister, my dad, my brother, and my grandma. Nice. Right, well, Kareem, thank you for being on, and be sure to to stay tuned to local providers. You'll have the opportunity to see Peninsula Catholic play this year and get to watch Kareem. And had the had a great experience this summer getting to see him and Styles and some of those guys play. So it'll be a lot of fun to watch. And we thank you for tuning in to Roland Sports, where you meet the athletes.